my channel today we are going to edit a 180 degree that that you can see here i'm going to edit this picture and post this on facebook timeline you can post this kind of pictures on facebook timeline covers so where you can just see just moving pictures 180 degree panoramic pictures and so on so i'm going to open this in snapseed okay after opening snapseed the first thing you have to do is click on the styles here click on accentuate okay after accentuating the picture would like this the warmth and the temperature also get increases and decreases here so after that click on the tick button here then click on tools again then click on white balance i'm going to decrease the temperature i'm going to keep to negative 50 okay after that click on the tick button here then the second thing we have to do is click on the tools again click on selective then select the greens here i'm going to increase the brightness a little bit the contrast and the saturation also okay after that click on tools again click on brush click on the saturation the saturation is 10 here i'm going to just brush here on this building so that i can get that saturation for that building okay after that click on the tick button there then the next thing we have to increase the saturation and structure of the floor to highlight it more so after for that click on tools then click on selective then select the down part here just increase the radius of the brush then just decrease the brightness increase the contrast increase the saturation and increase the structure okay after that again click on tools click on selective here we are going to edit this building so i'm going to select this part here just select the whole picture just increase the brightness and here you have to reduce the contrast and the saturation is just tiny bit okay then after that we have to increase the saturation of the blues again so that click on tools again click on selective then select this blues just increase the radius of the brush then just in decrease the brightness a tiny bit increase the contrast and increase the saturation okay after that again click on tools again click on tune image decrease the brightness just to negative 9 slide up increase the contrast just to 8 or something just again slide up increase the saturation just tiny just up to plus 10 that's better and this ambience also just okay in between 10 decrease the highlights slide up increase the shadows and here decrease the warmth just around five or something okay after that click on tools click on vintage okay then choose any one of these styles from here you can choose any one it's up to you I'm going to select this one and click on the tick button here so this is the edited image so this is also before one and this is after before after thank you so much for watching this video hope you love it if you like the video give it a thumbs up to watch my new contents just subscribe to my channel like comment if you have any doubts okay thank you so much just save the picture after editing so it will be found in the snapseed folder in your gallery
Okay.